Hello, you guys. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to curl your hair with a mini straightener. You don't have to use a mini, you can use a larger hair straightener. First, we're going to use some heat protectant. It depends on your hair type. So, if you curl your hair a lot and you want to know how to do it with a straightener or somewhere, you can use heat protectant if you use it a lot. If you curl your hair a lot, but if you curl your hair a lot, you probably know all the basics. So I'm just gonna teach you guys how. So I already put some in, I brushed out my hair, and now I'm gonna take my straightener. You're gonna wanna put your hair under it like this, wrap the hair around the straightener, and then push it up and clamp, just like that. And then you're just gonna wanna pull down a little slow. And you just want to go all the way down, just like that. And if it does not work, you might have a too thick of a piece like mine. So I also just did that so that I could explain to you why that may happen. So you can, of course, redo, wrap around, clamp. You can easily do this. And also, you guys, if you guys could follow me, subscribe to me, comment any extra things that you guys may know about curling hair, that would be amazing because I would love to read your guys' comments if they are good. And that is how you can curl your hair. If you want an even bigger curl, you can just um, go slower on your way down, but I'm going to show you guys this one more time. And also, if you guys want, you can take your hair and you can just scrunch it up to make it a pretty, a little bit more voluminous. I'm gonna show you guys this one more time and then I'm going to do a little transition. So you see, like I would mostly do like this much if you want a really nice curl. But you can also do like this. So that's just what we're gonna do. So we're gonna do this right now. Just gonna do that. Yeah. And we're just going to go ahead and go down slowly. So yeah. Wowzers! So that is exactly how you get those curls. Now, if you guys want, you can replay the video to redo. And I'm gonna go ahead and move on with my hair. So I'll see you once I'm all done with this half. Yeah! Got yeah, that curl that happened. Now I'm gonna take my brush and I'm just gonna brush them out lightly like that. You know, it's like a daily curl. I'll come back when I finish the other side. So I finished this side and I brushed through it a little with my fingers. And I'm just going to scrunch it up so that's even with the other side. So here's the final result before hairspray. Hope it looks good. Then I'm going to use the camera volume spray and we're just going to go ahead and spray that in my hair so that my curls will stay i'm going to put a lot so that they stay in hopefully for quite a while <laughs> Thank you. 
I'm just gonna let that dry for a second. And clip it up so that it's kind of like that. And we're just gonna look for the bez. Does it still look okay? I hope it does. Bye, you guys. Make sure to like, subscribe, comment any other details if this helped, if you already know, if, um, just comment whatever. Comment, like, anything that you want. And, yeah, my hair looks crazy, so I'm gonna fix that somehow. And also, please make sure to just comment. Please comment and subscribe. Those are my favorite things. And like and just please do those three things. That's all. And turn on the notification bell if you want to see more videos. Because I'm going to do a lot of hair videos. And yeah. I love hair. I do my hair every day for school in a different way every time. And it's always so cute. So please like subscribe and turn on the notifications if you want to see those videos and i can do beach waves i can do little buns anything that you guys want so comment that too bye